really don't think that's a good idea. Come on, relax, Corky. It's just a gag. I'm just changing a number in the phone company's computer. Well, all done. <laughs> now, whenever somebody tries to dial the Ghostbusters, they'll get a pizza parlor instead. <laughs> well, I guess that's kind of funny, Gene. But still, it might be dangerous. Oh, don't be such a doofus, Corky. Here, watch the master hacker in action again. I'll find us a new computer system to break into. But it's illegal to do that, Gene. Won't we get in trouble? No, nobody's gonna catch us. Even my parents are gonna be gone all night. It's perfectly safe. Come on, trust me, Corky. <sighs> Cousin Terra, you old horror. You're looking as loathsome as ever. Thank you, Prime Evil. The years have not made you any prettier yourself. So this is your new place. Looks hideous. Yes, I'm rather proud of it. Let me show you around. I'm glad you were able to come by, Terra. I have a little job for you. <laughs> but I'll explain that later. <coughs> Right now, let me just show you my new computer system. What... what is it, Gene? I... I don't know. I've broken into a computer system, all right, but I've never seen anything like it before. Maybe you'd better leave it alone. Get out of there before... Hey! Listen, you're talking to the master hacker here, remember? No system's gonna scare me off. We're going in. Here it is, Terra. My prime computer. The first step in my latest attempt to conquer the Earth. What's your plan? Simple. All the nuclear missiles of the world are controlled by computers. Using my prime computer, I will gain control of these missile systems while you keep the humans from interfering. And when I control the missiles, the Earth will be forced to bow to me! <laughs> Scared stiff, haven't you broken into a missile control computer system yet? Not yet, you're scaring us. Yes, it's not easy. <laughs> ah, you're just incompetent. I'll permit me, cousin. Why, of course, Terra. Anything for a guest? <laughs> Please, I'll try to do better. You have displeased your master, Scared Stiff. Now look into the face of terror. <laughs> Sorry, didn't mean to be so untidy. Yeah, he'll be all right. That worthless robot always falls apart like that. I'm more concerned about finding a better operator for my computer. What? What on earth is that? What on earth is that? It's a little animation program I wrote a while back. Thought I'd play it for whosever system this is. <laughs> you know, give who's ever watching it a laugh. This is not funny! Someone is mocking me! Someone has broken into my prime computer! Someone is going to... Wait... Yes! This could be my lucky break! I need someone who can break into computers, and here is someone breaking into mine! Terra, can you capture this person for me? Can I? <laughs> Just watch and see. You're not getting any response, Gene. Let's turn it off before... Wait, something's coming through now. What? What is it? I... I don't know, but I don't like it. I'm gonna turn it off before... Foolish human. You intruded where you should not have. 
Now you must pay the price. No! 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 Look, human! Look into the face of terror. Oh, wow! No! Oh, the Ghostbusters! Oh, ah. Come out, human! Oh, oh, no! Please, hurry! Antonio's pizza with a liver. I have need of your friend, human, but I have no need of you. But I want no interference. You must never tell anyone what happened here tonight, because if you do, I'll be back. And you'll look again into the face of terror. This is the life, eh, fellas? Ah. You said it, Eddie. On a night like this, I don't think anything could upset me. See who that is, will you, Belfry? <laughs> right, Jake? <laughs> what the heck? Well, tell him to come in, Belfry. He can have a hot dog. Uh, you'd better come here, Jake. I think something's happened to Corky. Uh-oh. Oh, no! Corky! Corky, are you all right? What happened? It... it was horrible! What was horrible, Corky? Tell us! I... I... I, I can't... I can't tell you. He said never to tell, so I can't. I can't. Don't you see, guys? I, I'm, I'm, so, I'm so scared of what would happen. Why don't you come inside for a while, Corky? I think we'd better have a little... No, I can't tell you. I can't. Look, Corky, until we know what happened, we can't help you. And the only way we can find out what happened is for you to tell us. No! I can't tell you! He said never to tell anyone! He said if I told anyone, he'd... He'd... He'd what, Corky? He'd... He'd... Come back! Please listen. We're your friends. We won't let anyone hurt you. But you have to help us. You have to tell us what happened. I can't! He said never to tell! Listen, son. The more someone threatens you to make you keep a secret, the more important it is that you tell someone about it as soon as possible. Someone you trust. <laughs> you trust us, don't you? Yeah, that's why I came here. Then please tell us what happened, Corky. Believe me, we won't let anything bad happen to you. We're your friends. We care about you. All right. I'll tell you, my friend Gene and I were messing with his computer. <laughs> oh, this is excellent, Terra! Excellent! This young computer operator you brought me is precisely what I required. He has already discovered a computer system that controls some nuclear missiles. He's doing much better than someone else I could mention was. Sorry, Primeval. I... Oh. Falls apart easily, doesn't he? Yes, I think he's got a screw loose somewhere. Ah! The human has broken the computer security codes. <laughs> As soon as he gains control of the computer, you take over! <laughs> yes! Uh-oh, Lieutenant, we've got something odd here. What is it, Corporal? 
I'm getting an odd interference pattern on the main missile control system, sir. Take a look. What do you make of it, sir? Hmm. I don't know what that is, but I don't like it. I'll switch to override. Uh, oh. You'll do nothing, human. Save look into the face of terror. <laughs> So you say that this night of terror took your friend Jean back to Haunt Quarters with him? Yes! Oh, it was horrible! He told me never to tell, or he would come back! You did the right thing to tell us, Corky, because now we can do something about it! Let's go! Go! like normal people to haunt quarters Tracy wait yeah let's wait like forever I'm going to no Corky it's too dangerous but Jean's my friend I have to go besides I'm scared to stay by myself the night of terror might come back easy Corky remember the only weapon terror has is fear all it can do is scare you if you're not scared, he can't hurt you. All right, Corky, you can go, but you have to stay with GP out of danger. No problem, Jake. Staying out of danger was sort of what I had in mind. <laughs> My plan is working perfectly, Tara. Already, I control half the nuclear missiles in the world, and as soon as I control the other half, I will control the universe! <laughs> Cosmos! It's the Ghostbusters! They're coming here! What? They must be trying to rescue this human. But how could they have found out? It must have been that other boy. He must have told. He will regret that. You'll have time for your revenge later, Terra. Right now, we have to prepare for... The Ghostbusters! Uh-oh. Looks like somebody saw us coming. Can you get us inside, Tracy? Sure. No problem. <laughs> Nice work, Tracy. <laughs> now let's get going, guys. We've got ghosts to bust. Now, my evil legions! Get them! Yeah. Oh, wow. 
did that. I, I, I was... For that, you must pay. Ha, that's the last of him. Now, Prime Evil, where is Corky's friend Gene? I, uh, I, uh, mm. come on, we haven't got no Corky. I told you what would happen if you told, foolish human. Now, look into the face of terror. No, no! Remember, the only weapon terror has is fear. All he can do is scare you. If you're not scared, he can't hurt you. You can't hurt me. You can't hurt me, you stupid ghost. I'm not scared of you at all. Hey, I'm free. Now I can use this computer to cause trouble for Prime Evil. All right, you did it, Corky. You defeated the Knight of Terror. That may be, but you have not defeated me. I shall... What's going on? Great. I don't know where that water came from, but it sure got us free from prime evil. Now let's grab Gene and get out of here. Here I am. I'm coming. Gene, you're all right. I guess Terror's spell has been broken. That's not all that's been broken. Prime Evil's computer controlled everything in Hot Quarters. As you can see, I reprogrammed it a little. Nice going, Gene. That should keep Prime Evil busy long enough for us to get out of here. So let's get going! Boy, it sure is gonna take Prime a long time to get Hot Quarters back under control. That's for sure. It'll keep him out of trouble for a while. Now, what say we all go back to the office and celebrate by ordering out for a pizza? Corky tells me you know a real good place to call, Gene. Uh, sorry, Jake. <laughs> I'll switch your phone number back just as soon as I get home. You better. The Exabone's getting hungry taking all those pizza orders. <laughs> <laughs> In today's story, Corky was scared. The Knight of Terror told him to tell no one what happened to Gene, but Corky told the Ghostbusters because he knew that telling was the right thing to do. If someone threatens you to make you keep a secret, then something is wrong, very wrong. Don't be afraid and tell someone you trust, like your parents or a good friend, because a secret based on fear is a secret you shouldn't keep. Tell someone. Bye now, see you soon.